How you guys doing? This is Mass Mods. I uh, I'm making this video just to let you guys know that I was able to successfully unlock and jailbreak my iPhone 4. Um, I have a T-Mobile SIM card in there right now, but um, it's a prepaid card, so I have no service at the moment. But I just did this for testing purposes, just to see if I could do it. Um, excuse my voice because I'm uh, kind of out of breath and I just got over a cold. But anyways, just to show you guys that I, that I have proof that I jailbroke um, iOS 7.1 successfully. Um, this, it's still in, in beta testing because there's still a lot of work to be done. Um, as you guys may very well know, um, or you might not know. Um, but here is just a, a general overview so you guys can see. Um, okay, my carrier. Uh, automatic, obviously. Um, my Wi-Fi. That's my Wi-Fi wireless signal. Um, but yeah, right down to the, the dirtiness of it. General about... Hopefully you guys can see that. I'm on T-Mobile. It's an unlocked phone. It was originally AT&T. Had it factory unlocked way back in the day. Modem firmware 04.12.09. It's uh, factory unlocked. Um, and I'm just going to go back here so you guys can see it. Um, it has everything that you would expect the uh, 7.1 uh, firmware to have um, just go back here so you guys can make sure that it's definitely 7.1 see version 7.1 it's 11D169 I think you guys can see it a little bit better there um, and that's pretty much that and then I'm gonna go back here so you guys can see that I do have Cydia installed as well as some of the repos that I um, decided to put on there um, uh, okay so this is just my main screen I have my magic jack talk button my phone my mail and my uh, Safari my internet um, but it is 7.1 as you can see the city icon is definitely there it works but the problem is that none of the apps uh, meaning repos um, they none of them load successfully that you know to the point where you can actually do stuff with it but it is working so there's that and it is um, a step in the right direction so that's uh, good. Th one of the good things about it, I got Basim Casim on there, so I can get my um, my Sir my Siri on there on the iPhone 4. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. When uh, just an example, when you guys um, go to any any of these things, any of the normal repos, you won't get to see anything because it's still obviously it's not ready to be released yet and um, there's really no point for you guys to be able to do this I'm just doing this as a courtesy to you guys so that you can see that it is not a fake um, go to search changes manage um, changes uh, sections I mean you can see that the the main page of it works perfectly fine um, reloading it works perfectly fine as well. Oh, let me do this. Yeah. It just, I mean, there's not really much to it right now. But, um, this is definitely a big leap forward in the right direction. At the bottom here, you can see it says iPhone 3, comma, 1, comma, iOS 7.1, comma, Cydia 1.1.9, English dash US and then uh, my you know my hash co code underneath um, and what else do I need here developers useful developer resources um, 
iPhoneDevWiki.net, uh, run by D. H. Howitt, D. Howitt, and then the iPhoneWiki.com. So yeah, I mean, there's uh, there's definitely potential here. So guys, don't give up hope, and um, you know, soon enough we should have something for you. Um, to go on, you know, as far as uh, repos and whatnot, so that you guys have something to use. Um, but right now, that's pretty much it. I mean, like I said, I can show you all the repos. iHackStore.com, there's nothing. It's basically just trying to get everything on there and get it working. Um, so we don't really have any repos to... <laughs> to have to, to to work with right now so there is um there is that so um again but just to show you guys that i'm not you know yanking your chain i'm gonna hook it up to my itunes and you guys can see it firsthand that it is definitely on 7.1 okay mm -hmm. Let me just open up my iTunes. Okay. iTunes. I am on the latest iTunes. So, um, okay. It's loading. And I would be using my other phone to do this, but because it has the better camera. As you can see at the top, it says iOS 7.1. A newer version of the iPhone software is available, obviously 7.1.1, and I suggest you do not update. <laughs> do not update. Um, so stay at 7.1 for now, and progress will be made. Um, you just got to give it time. Now let me tilt it to the side here, so make it easy for you guys to see. Um, you just got to give it more time, and we'll get to it when we can. Um, obviously, and as you can see, there's, uh, Cydia right there, that's one of my apps, um, I don't have really anything on there, because this was all for testing purposes, um, but yeah, there's, uh, not many people are familiar with how to get Cydia on there, and I'm not about to show anybody, because this is not something that I want to release to the public yet, um, as well as many others, uh, but as you can see, it is definitely on there, and there is potential for it, it is just a, a matter of waiting and seeing what's going on um, with some of the developers and what we can do um, working together as a team, so there, there's that, um, yeah, I gotta fix this, this thing keeps on popping up with the, uh, the failed um, h7.org, h7v.org, it keeps on showing up, it's failed, um, but yeah, we're going to have to work on that, anyways, um, yeah, that's just my short video to show you that, again, at the bottom here, it says it clear as day, um, not sure if you guys can see it or not, or how clear it is, but I'm doing my best here, at the very bottom between sections and that star and everything it does say iPhone 3 comma 1 comma iOS 7.1 which is something that none of us thought was going to happen anytime soon but it did uh, Cydia 1.1.9 English dash United States and the, obviously my iPhone 4 is fully factory unlocked from back in the day when it was actually cheap now it costs like fucking, oh, sorry about the language, it costs a lot of money to unlock. As you can see, even with the city of packages, the ones that it comes with, there's nothing. So it's it's a matter of we need to just wait um, until everything gets added back in, and it's going to take some time. And this is, um, to be a little bit more informative about it, it is a semi-untethered jailbreak which means you do still have to, um, you know, use a certain thing to reboot the iPhone 4 um, 
to get Sedia to open. Otherwise, it just closes like in like with the tether jailbreaks. Um, but you can still use the rest of the phone as normal. Um, you know, you can go to your messages. You can use your phone. Uh, you can do all that stuff. Um, I'm gonna just call my house here so you guys can see. This is my Magic Jack app, which is actually pretty cool. It has nothing to do with Cydia, but I'm just gonna show you guys. Um, yeah, well, I'm not gonna do that. Let me try this. And you guys can see that I can call my house. Oh, I turned my uh, my ringer off. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's my my magic jack, and it is. Um, I don't know why, but I turned my ringer off. Anyways, that's uh, that's pretty much it. I'm using my my phone through my internet, and um, to call you know out. It's a pretty cool thing if you get the magic jack. Um, it's nice to have. I'm also working on the iPhone 5 when I get that. When that comes in, I have the case. There it is. Ugh. I got my life case today, and uh, I'll be getting my iPhone 5 pretty soon. So I'm going to see about adding the 7.1 um, Cydia onto that phone as well. Um, as you can see, it is there. It's not fake. There's no hoax. It's just a matter of getting it um, fully functional so that people can actually use it and get use out of it. So, and as you can see, it is 7 o'clock in the morning, and I did have a breakthrough with it. So, um, I just wanted you guys to know and share that with you guys right now. So, there is that. You can add all the repos you want to it, um, but you can't use anything yet, so... That's the downside. Alrighty, um, this is Mass Mods, also known as Matt. Um, so I'll talk to you guys later. If you guys have any questions, feel free and post on my page, um, or join or go over to uh, www.usbjtag.net. Um, go to the forum section and uh, ask either Capone USB. BDM or Mr. Rogers if you guys uh, have any questions about this. Alrighty, have a good one. Take care and happy Mother's Day yesterday. Alright, bye.